Hi everyone, this is Teacher Jane again. Our lesson for today is all about evaluating polynomial functions. The examples that I'm going to discuss were lifted from the Mathematics 10, Quarter 2, Module, Page 6. I'm going to discuss the solution to learning task 1 on page number 6, as shown in my slide. Evaluate the following polynomials in your answer sheet. There are A f of x is equal to x to the fourth minus 7x squared plus 2x minus 6 at x is equal to 1. Letter B, f of x is equal to 10x cubed plus 4x squared minus 5 at x is equal to negative 3. And letter C, f of x is equal to x to the fourth plus 5x cubed minus 2x plus 3. Find f of 2 squared. So let's start with evaluating these functions using our mathematics module. Let us now evaluate the first question. f of x is equal to x to the fourth minus 7x squared plus 2x minus 6 when x is equal to 1. So it simply means that all your x variables, you have to simply substitute it with the value 1. Okay. Then we are now going to solve f of 1. So, x to the fourth will become 1 raised to the fourth power minus 7 1 raised to the second power plus 2 times 1 minus 6. You can actually get an instant answer by using your calculator. But anyway, I'm going to show you how to do this manually. So 1 raised to the fourth power is simply 1 minus 1 square is 1 times negative 7 is 7 plus 2 times 1 is 2 then minus 6. Combining all of this, you get 1 plus 2 is 3 Negative 7 and negative 6 is negative 13. So we have a negative 10. So the value of f of 1 okay, is negative 10. Let's box the final answer. Given f of x is equal to x to the fourth plus 5x cubed minus 2x plus 3, find f of 2 raised to the second power. So we have to solve first f of 2. Then the value of f of 2 okay, will then be squared so that we can get now f of 2 squared. So in solving this, let's write f of 2. Now, we are going to substitute 2 and 2 here and 2 here. So, 2 to the fourth power is 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, which is 16. Then, 2 to the third power is 2 times 2 times 2, 8 times 5 is positive 40. Then, 2 times negative 2 is negative 4. And then you have plus 3. Then we combine first 16 and 40, which is 56. Plus 3 is 59. Minus 4 is 55. So, this is the value of f of 2. But what we are solving is f of 2 raised to the second power. So to continue, let us now solve for f of 2 raised to the second power, so which is parallel with 55 raised to the second power. So in this case, I'm going to use now a calculator 
and solve for 55 raised to the second power. So, 55 times 55, okay, is equal to 3,025. Okay, so this is our f of 2, okay, raised to the second power. Okay, I hope that I was able to help you understand and solve learning task 1, A, and C. And I hope you do watch my next video. It's all about answering learning task 2. So, goodbye!